and welcome to the uh, 10th anniversary of Play Channel and uh, today's a happy day for everyone and all so It's our 10th birthday, and oh. I am talking here now to Liam, Liam Cunningham, yeah. and Liam Cunningham has just, Liam, you just won the Swords Young Magician of the Year. So Liam, tell us something about the notoriety that you've achieved as a no. winning that. You probably have been in the paper. Yeah. 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 Think all independent. Think all independent as well, independent as, well um, as well as the North Side people. Yeah. So he's well known around the North Side of Dublin. So Liam, what piece, you'd like to tell the people what piece you played for winning the Swords Young Magician. And by the way, folks, you was under 15 and he beat the under 18th and the other, and the other 20 ones. Yeah. Uh, played the Maple Leaf Row with Scott Chaplin. Terrific. Difficult piece to play, Liam. Yeah. Folks, that's an A-flat major. How long did it take to learn that, Liam? Six months. Six months. Six months. Six months. Yeah, because looking in now, Lee, we'll have other students who, since hearing you play that, want to learn to play it. So it's a good idea to have you here chatting away saying, oh, that took me six months, but what would you say if anybody wants to tackle it? Uh, just practice loads, because it's... <laughs> practice loads. Don't be afraid of it. So, Mr. Keane Simpson, and Keane now uh, did very well in the Swords Young Musician, didn't you, Keane? Yeah. What did you get? You came joint second. Tell all the people on the Facebook page and the website you got joint second of the 12. No, right? And you played the entertainment, you played it ever so well. And you're growing up too now, very big. Because Liam came in to me as he was that way, but you down there somewhere, didn't you? Boys and girls are looking in, would you tell them how long you practice? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Now, is that a day, is it? A day. Uh, what? Once a week, is it? No, not once a week. What? what is it? Are there any words of wisdom for the people looking at who are trying to learn to play the entertainer and what to say to them? <laughs> you know what? You know, that's great words of advice, Kane. Well done, because Scott Joplin always said that not to play his pieces too fast. Okay, well, we say hi and goodbye. Hi, okay. okay, hi folks, and uh, we're back again now, and I'm sitting here with one of our new teachers, uh, Elena O'Neill. Hi, Elena. Hi. And uh, it, it, proved, it proved very different to tie Elena down for a few minutes. She's so busy at playing piano, then, right, Elena? Yeah. Now, Elena, how long have you been working to play piano? Um, I'm working since November. Since November, very good, Jen. Where are from? I'm from Ukraine, and um, I'm in Ireland for 11 years. Very good. And. Um, <laughs> and we walk, and when Elena came knocking on the door, I wanted to make sure we got her because she's a terrific thing to smoke. So if you're going to hear her playing some days, we will get her onto the Facebook or our website playing. Is that right, Elena? Yeah. Now, Elena's teaching, you're teaching two days a week now. Yeah. And two you're days. loving it. I love it. You're very good. <laughs> I'm so happy, yeah. And you got, so you got, you got new plans. So do you want to say anything to your students, Elena, that you're teaching? Or, um, to my students? Your students are teaching, or maybe say people looking in. <laughs> I enjoy every moment teaching uh, my students yeah. and we have a great fun and um, the place it's friendly and happy and <laughs> so we have a 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 great oh, my my nephew is dropping in there folks don't worry folks I'll get my nephew in a few minutes you can go over there Sean for a few minutes okay very good okay um, Santa now you had a very successful year now last year where you did very well with one year cat with the soldier music of the year and you got to sing in grade four and how did you get on this year? It was a really good year for me. I started the violin in September um, and I did my grade uh, primary exam in November and I got my results. I got a distinction. Terrific. So you used to get distinctions. distinction. Yeah. So Sandra's got a distinction all the way up from all her grades and she's working on grade five and we're hoping she's going to go for distinction. That's that right. Okay. And she took up the violin and she got a distinction in her first exam in primary. My God, I'm like, distinction all the way home. So we'll okay, right. Um, what would you say to them about practicing? How often do you practice? I practice, try practice an hour every day. An hour every day, very good. Yeah, practice is really important. Because when you're getting on to grade five and grade six level, you have yeah. to start doing that, don't you? Yeah. And everything else. And you haven't started singing yet. <laughs> no. no, we're trying to get Santa to sing, folks, but maybe later on we get to sing anyway. Yeah. Uh, Peter, tell us what you're working on at the moment of playing. Oh, I'm doing grade five. Grade five, yeah, very good. And you're loving that, are you? Yeah. 
and you just have to play a lovely piece of music on our, on our, on our show. Yeah, what was that called? Uh, Lamata. Lamata by Jan Tiersen. Yeah. And that's a tricky piece, isn't it? Yeah. Because you kind of have to have big hands with that. Yeah, yeah. No. Okay, tell us, what do you think about playing piano? Uh, it's good. So we're good. Are we great? We're great. We're, we're, we're building up. And we're with Alexandra Guava now. Hi, Alexandra. Hi. And thank you for stopping by for a couple of seconds today. Thank you. Are you enjoying the concert? Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah. It's nice hearing everyone else play. Great. And what did you just play there a couple of seconds ago? Um, it's by Anne Tiersen. It's, I call it the Comte, the easier version. Comte de Notre AJ. Folks, Alexandra is an enthusiast of Jan Tiersen. There's so many Jan Tiersen pieces off there, right? Yeah. Now you did when you were grade 5 there recently? Yeah, I got distinction. Distinction. Very good. Well up in the high 90s. Yeah. And we're going to get you into your grade 6 now, please, go going forward. Yeah, please. How long do you practice for? Um, I practice every day. I practice around 45 minutes. It kind of depends. Um, I play everything I know. Okay, that's exactly so. That, that's a very good, another very good thing. Play everything you know, that's very important. Yeah. yeah, so you practice your things you're working on and then entertain yourself outside of that in that way, isn't it? Yeah. And what you did well at grade three, yeah. you're drawn in grade three, and you're doing your, you're doing your first yeah. recite, isn't it? You're doing your recite. And how are those pieces going, Adam? They're going okay, yeah, getting there. And what would you tell? There's some people now looking in now, Adam, who will be coming up after you, they'll be doing grade three this year, and then they'll be looking at their recital. What do you think about it? Do you think it's good or? Should you do it? We generally do the recital folks in between grade three and grade four. Do you think it's worth doing, Adam? Yeah, pairs of a grade four. Excellent stuff. Because, you know, folks, we have some great intelligent students here, Adam, that are saying great things. The, the last girl said, enjoy your music. Now, Adam says, prepares you, very good, prepares you for grade four. So it does that, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Because sometimes we went to grade four, two, soon from grade three. We might be still playing grade four piece and maybe a grade three standard or something. Yeah, yeah, think? yeah, yeah. Any words of wisdom, Adam, about practicing for other students that are looking, looking into this? How would you go about practicing? How often do you spend practicing? Um, I'm trying to get up to about an hour a day, so. Good, good. Yeah, excellent, yeah. Especially for grade four, so. Yeah. And we should do that in the morning time, maybe, whatever it is. Yeah, I break it up throughout the day, so. Great. And you're done. Yeah. You love YouTube, don't you? Yeah. You love it. Yeah. <laughs> Julian here is a YouTube fanatic. Everything that's going on YouTube, Julian knows about it. He keeps telling us to play piano. Not right, all the songs.